1970 Buick LeSabre. So I went ahead and put down a fourth glamour coat today. <sighs> Which I painted it glamour coated for 35 minutes and then I actually dumped it. But at 45 minutes, 30 to 45 minutes, this stuff gets hard. And if it gets hard inside the gun, it turns into like super glue. So that was enough. And this is, that'll be the final glamour coat now. <sighs> Pull the tape off next and then wax it. That ought to bring it to a perfect shine. Urethane, or uricam, I think it's sometimes called. Base coat with a glamour coat. I decided to go with one more glamour coat to get out any imperfections that the third one left. I've done this a few times with this style paint, and this is about how good it gets, except for, you know, taking, the funnest part's really taking the tape and the paper off, and that plastic sack around the rear view mirror. It really looks better after that. But then, I'll follow up with a product like, in fact, I even keep an extra one on hand in case I run out. Turtle wax. You can just spray it on, but you still have to buff it out. It's just a little easier than, you know, like a cream or something. And I know you see the people using the creamy stuff and then they get a buffer on it and all this. Well, I've, I've done that too myself, but Since I'm doing it by hand, I use the spray stuff. It's a little easier. So that's it with the final glamour coat. And now I'm gonna say I'm satisfied the paint job has been completed. And then we'll remove the paper and the tape and you know, the plastic and we'll wax the car. So this is John Rudy with Rudy Racing. Signing off.